So right now you are living at home with your parents. Yes, sir. And that's not going very well. No, sir. And it's because they're smothering you? Yes, sir. You're saying that you're doing drugs and carrying guns and selling drugs and you're not going to school. So what, as a parent, what should they say to you about this right now? I guess you could say start over and show them that I'm not gonna get in trouble every time I go outside. I feel like the past couple of years has been a pain in the ass because I feel like my parents just want me to be perfect. I feel like my parents are making a way bigger deal out of all this than it really is. I don't consider myself a thug. I don't feel like I'm a gangster. What I am is just a chill person. When I moved, I started smoking about two to three grams a day. It was about $30 worth in a bag, it'd be like that. Sure, I've tried a lot of other drugs. I've tried molly, acid, jiggas, oxys, hydros, and methamphetamine. The drug I like the best is weed and Xanax. I like guns because people know not to try and rob you or mess with you. All my friends have guns. If they don't have guns, we make fun of them. They're kind of like the joke of the day. I uh, would love to get my hands on a .40 with a 32 extended clip. All my friends, they call me Dolph. There's a rapper named Dolph. I you know is always having more than one gun and always having weed on me. At this point, I really don't want to live at home. I don't want to be there at all. My parents are so strict with me, it's gonna eventually turn around and bite them in the ass. They only watch me for so long, and as soon as I hit 17, I'm leaving. When it comes to my future, I'm kind of clueless. I don't know what I want to do. My parents need to get off my back because I know what I'm doing and I don't need help at this point. Well, Dawson, how are you? Pretty good, how about you? I'm okay. Um, so right now, you are living at home with your parents. Yes, sir. And that's not going very well. No, sir. And it's because they're smothering you? Yes, sir. You're saying that you're doing drugs and carrying guns and selling drugs and you're not going to school. So what, as a parent, what should they say to you about this right now? I guess you could say start over and show them that I'm not gonna get in trouble every time I go outside or not trying to do something every time I go outside. Uh -huh. Well, you, you said something was interesting. You said, um, I wrote it down because I thought it was real interesting. You said, I know what I'm doing. What is that? I just mean like, do you think every time I go outside, there's a chance of me getting killed or in trouble when it's not? You say that you are constantly smoking dope, right? And that you're also distributing it. And that because people know that you have it on you, so you have to carry a gun to protect yourself. If you don't, you're just putting a target on your back. You're 15, so you're carrying an illegal substance and an illegal firearm and walking around on the street. That's what you mean when you say, I know what I'm doing. Pretty much. Have you ever shot a gun? Yeah. Have you ever shot a gun at anybody? Uh -huh. You say what you would like to have is a, an extended clip in a 40 caliber, was that it, or the nine millimeter? Which one would you? 40. You want the 40 caliber with an extended clip, which is also illegal, but so that way you can shoot like 32 rounds. Is it a 32 round clip? Okay, so you can throw a lot of lead in a short period of time. So you're anticipating what kind of firefight here? Uh, just you have a target on your back if you have weed or if you have a lot of people don't like me yeah and so you think you need 32 rounds of ammunition to protect yourself on the street you're so that way you can shoot your way out of trouble